Dilkusha came in, or with love, as we say, Dilkush came in, is serving people of Kolkata for a century now. The traditional Kobiraji and Cutlet continue to strike a chord with youngsters as they did a century ago. Dilkush came in, I have Dilkush This is Dilkush Kevin, just at the crossing of College Street, just opposite Adi Mohinamon Kanjila. And we have ordered uh, mutton cutlet or mutton kobiraji, chili chicken that's boneless, uh, chicken noodles, and this is their famous fish kobiraji. This is excellent. Give yeah, me a bite. Look, wait, wait. The coating itself is very tasty. Is this your first time here? No, no. I have been here many times. But this taste never gets old. Oh. So this is their mutton kobiraji. Mince mutton. Are you getting chunks in it? Yeah. Okay. A few chunks. A little chunky, a little mm. mince. Listen, mm. I think the masala, the flavor inside it is quite strong. So, for a perfect bite, uh, a piece of the kobiraji, dip it in mustard. Kashan leaf. mustard and kashan Same thing. And add some onion to it. There was a big mighty bite. Okay. But still the fish kaviraji remains the best. Prices are mind-boggling. The mutton kobiraji is just 140. Fish kobiraji is 140 again. Chow mein is uh, 125. And chili chicken tagota. 140. 140. So, so 140, I think, is their favorite number. <laughs> so we'll keep this aside for a bit. Chow mein is good. Is good. Street food style. Street food style. At this price, so many items with this quality, it's rare to find. So this is their chicken chow mein. It's full of chicken. But it's actually not boiled and added to the chow mein. It's fried and like the chicken pakoras are fried and added to it. The chili chicken is good, decent, okay. I like it because it's spicy. Ah. Well, dil khush, Kevin, may I ask you, dil khush again? Khush. Okay. Bad, bad. This place is recommended to them who like the delicious old Kolkata snacks with a dose of nostalgia.